Hi, in this video we're going to graph this function and we're going to find the domain and the range. Let's go ahead and jump into its solution. So let me just draw it like this. Here's the y-axis, here's the x-axis. So there's y and there's x. And basically no matter what x is, f of x is 5. So remember that this is the same thing as y equals 5. So the y value is going to be 5 no matter what. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. It's always going to be 5. So basically you're just looking at a horizontal line, y equals 5. So that's the graph. Now the domain is the set of all inputs. It's all the x values that give you y values. So we can do it two ways. Looking at the graph, no matter what x value I pick, I'm always going to get a y value. So the domain is all real numbers. Looking at the function, we can argue the same, a similar way. No matter what x value I plug in here, I'm going to get 5. And there's no restrictions, right? I'm not dividing by x. There's no square roots. There's nothing, nothing funny going on, right? So all real numbers. Range is all the possible y values. So the range, in this case, is a single number. It's the number 5, because that's the only y value. Kind of cool, right? I hope this problem has been helpful to someone. Good luck.